Hello Dental Squad. Hope you all are doing very well. So in today's video, we are going to discuss about the human dentition and the dental formula of the teeth. So first of all, we'll discuss about human dentition. Like human dentition could be some stuff related to the teeth, but what exactly it means? Let us know and understand the definition of human dentition. So let us begin. Human dentition is defined as the characteristic arrangement, kind and number of teeth in humans. Or in simple words, the study of teeth pattern and their functions in humans is called as human dentition. We have learned some concepts related to the teeth and now we'll learn a few more. So in a particular species, how the teeth are arranged, what are the characteristic features of those teeth like the shape, size, etc. And also how many teeth are present in total is what the dentition tells us. If I ask that what is the total number of teeth in humans, you'll instantly tell me it's 32. But is that the case with everyone? Let us know about it. Humans like other mammals are diphyodont. In simple words, diphyodont means teeth occur in two sets. One is the deciduous and the other is the permanent teeth. We know that a few months after birth, a set of teeth begin to appear in babies. These teeth are called the milk teeth, the primary teeth or even the deciduous teeth. After the deciduous teeth fall away, the next set of permanent teeth begin to appear. So, primary and then the permanent are the two sets of teeth in the life of humans due to which we are called as diphyodont. Now, talking about the number of teeth. So, it's 20 in the deciduous teeth. And the growth of the entire set of deciduous teeth is generally completed by a time a child is 2 or 3 years of age. Next on the list is the permanent one. It starts developing at around 5 to 6 years of age, as you can see. So, the 32 milk teeth replace the 20 deciduous teeth. Now let us discuss about the number of each kind of teeth. So there are formulae to understand the dentition pattern in different mammals including humans. So they are called as the dental formulae. The number and arrangement of teeth in the humans form the human dental formula. For an adult human, the dental formula is given as 2123 upon 2123. And how is that read? Take this diagram for example. Here, let us focus on the upper jaw first. If we divide the complete jaw in equal halves, we get two incisors, one canine, two premolars and three molars. So this makes up eight teeth on one side of the upper jaw. You can count one, two, three, four, five, six, seven and eight. Same is the case with the other half. So eight and eight gives us 16 teeth in the upper jaw okay now what about the lower jaw so we also get 16 teeth from the lower jaw and together we get 32 teeth on adding the ones from both the jaws since we have two incisors, one canine, two premolars, three molars on both upper and lower jaws on each side, we write the formula as 2123 upon 2123. Now let us discuss about dentition of the milk teeth or the primary teeth. If we divide the complete jaw in equal halves, we get two incisors, 
वन कैनाइन नो प्री मोलर्स एंड टू मोलर्स सो दिस मेक्स अप फाइव टीथ ऑन वन साइड ऑफ द अपर जो सो वी हैव वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव टीथ same is the case with the other half so 5 and 5 gives us 10 teeth in the upper jaw now what about the lower jaw let us discuss so we also get 10 teeth from the lower jaw together we get 20 teeth on adding the ones from both the jaws mm.